Number five, uh, we're given a function. What points on the graph have the property that the tangent line to F has a slope of one half? So we're talking about a slope of a tangent line. The slope equals one half. So what we want to do is we're going to find the X's for which the derivative is equal to one half. That means the slope is one half. So we're going to start by finding the derivative of this function here. So that's going to be quotient rule because I have one function x divided by another function x plus 2. So the derivative of the numerator times recopy the denominator minus recopy the numerator times the derivative of the denominator all over the denominator squared. So then we want to find the x values that make that one half. So first I'm going to simplify a little bit x plus 2 minus x in the numerator x plus 2 over x plus 2 squared. Uh, so now I've got f prime of x equals 2 over x plus 2 squared. So now I want to set that equal to 1 half. Find what x is, at what x values does the slope have a tangent line of 1 half. So I'm going to cross multiply here and get x plus 2 squared equals 4. Uh, I can square root both sides to get x plus 2 equals plus or minus 2. That's the key, right? Remember, I'm square rooting, so when I square root, I get two answers, which creates now two new equations. So x plus 2 equals 2. Uh, I solve that and get x equals 0. This guy, I get x equals negative 4. So it occurs at an x value of 0, and the tangent lines at those points, now they want the points on the curve, so we're looking for the point of tangency for each one which means I plug them back in. Those are the x values where my slope is 1 half on this curve. So if I plug 0 back into f, f of 0 gets me 0 over 0 plus 2, which is 0. And then negative 4 gets me negative 4 over negative 4 plus 2, which is negative 4 over negative 2, which is 2. So 0, 0, negative 4, 2.